Joining us now is Margaret Leinen, who is Vice Provost of Marine and Environmental Initiatives and Executive Director of the Harbor Branch Oceanographic Institute, uh, a unit that's located in Fort Pierce. First of all, tell us, how is science connected to climate change and a lot of what's going on here at the conference? Of course, science is really the basis of trying to understand what is going to change, how it's going to change, and when it's going to change. Those are the big questions. Science has played a critical role in framing this entire discussion uh, about change in climate and climate impacts uh, by early on saying we think that climate is going to change and then with time becoming more and more specific about that. We know that this has happened. We know that this is likely to happen. We think that this may happen. And I think that, that embedded in that, what we know, what we think, what we speculate is really the, that's the realm of science and the real challenge in conveying what we know, what we don't know. And there's a lot of different folks here from a lot of different disciplines. What about science and policymakers and the science community understanding sort of the other side of, of the climate change uh, problem? Well, I think that one of our big challenges right now is to have policymakers and resource managers both tell us what they need to know. So, for example, um, if I said that uh, the average rainfall was going to increase in the northern tier states in, in North America, as we think it will from our models, uh, is that what a water manager needs to know? Probably not. They need to know what, what's going to happen to the extremes because they already manage to the extremes. How much water can we hold behind a dam? What, uh, what will be the, the high stand of the river uh, at, at such and such a time? And so there, their question might not have anything to do with averages. It might, might be, what are the extremes of rainfall that we're going to see? That's a very different question. It's kind of a juicier science problem. It's a tougher science problem. And by understanding what we're talking about and what, we, what policymakers and decision and resource managers need to know, science can give better answers. Margaret Leinen, thank you for joining us today. Thanks.